Well, millions of travelers are beginning to hit the roads and the skies today on what's expected to be one of the busiest travel days of the holiday season. Instead of snow, many along the eastern part of the country could be delayed by severe thunderstorms. Don Champion has the very latest from New York. From the roads <laughs> to the friendly skies, people across the U.S. are making their way home for the holidays. It's always levels of craziness. There's a long line on the gate when I was pulling up. I was like, oh no, how long is this going to take? For the first time, AAA predicts the number of people making a journey 50 or more miles between Christmas and New Year's will top 100 million, making it the seventh consecutive year of growth. We thought we'd go today instead of tomorrow, so I know tomorrow will be a nightmare. The holiday rush comes as severe thunderstorms and tornadoes threaten parts of the South and Midwest. We've got cold, dry air coming down across the plains and very unusually warm, moist air that's being lifted up out of the Gulf of Mexico. And so we're really watching this area in particular. Storms grounded several flights at San Francisco International Airport Tuesday. Christina Durana and her kids were on their way to Disneyland. It's their Christmas gift from their aunt here in, in San Francisco. Yeah, and this is the first time we are supposed to be together, you know, for Christmas. Rounds of heavy rain are expected across the eastern part of the country ahead of spring-like weather Christmas Day. Don Champion, CBS News, New York. Now, experts say the busy travel season is being fueled in part by renewed confidence in the economy and low gas prices.